Hey everyone, Phil here from Nerdly, coming at you with another unboxing. Uh, this time, it's a brand new box we've never done before. These guys have been going for a while. Um, it is, you see that there, Monthly Tea Club. Obviously, it does exactly what it says on the tin, it's a monthly tea club. Uh, yep, so you get t shirts every month. Um, these guys have been around, actually, been quite a while. It says there, 2015. Um, it's a lot like a lot of the boxes, you go on the website, you select your, what kind of things you're interested in, what things you're not interested in, and they'll sort of curate t-shirts based on your interests. Um, they reached out to us and said, you know, we've seen your unboxings on, uh, on your website as well, uh, you know, for that other super loot and stuff, and wondered if you'd like to take a look, a look at uh, our t-shirts. Uh, of course, I said, yeah, go on then. Well, uh, you know we like these mystery boxes. It's not so much a mystery, if you know, it's just t-shirts, obviously, really. So, Monthly Tea Club, pricing, it's a little complicated, so I'm gonna read my notes. So you got one t-shirt a month, 9.99. Uh, you got two t-shirts a month is 17.99. Four t-shirts a month is 29.99. Uh, and those are all unlicensed, so it's their own designs. Um, you know, based on each other, it's like you have video games, movies, but none of these are licensed, so they'll be like their own proprietary designs and stuff. But then you've got a subscription where you can get an official merch t-shirt. One a month is $14.99. And then there's also a hoodie option, one hoodie a month, $24.99. So there's quite a lot of choice. Um, what's also interesting is that these guys also run a thing called T4T. So money that's raised through subscriptions, given to charity and stuff. Uh, and, and if you go on their Facebook page, you can see they, they show them handing out checks and things. It's pretty cool. Yeah, there's a lot of choice, uh, starting at $9.99. So we've got the two t-shirt box, which is $17.99. Um, I went through the selections. Uh, I think I picked up movies, video games, comics and stuff. This, it can be like science and technology. There's a lot of choices. But yeah, so we shall... I've already opened it for ease of... Well, slice the tape for ease of opening. Let's crack the box. And as you can see, inside we have t-shirts. So two t-shirts. First one, as you've probably already seen, is a Sonic the Hedgehog t-shirt. Put this over it, out of the way. So these aren't licensed, but they're their own designs. Oh, this is pretty cool. Like a sort of an 80s vibe Sonic t-shirt saying too slow. Um, these are all, as usual, a lot of these t-shirt companies, this is a Gildan soft style, so it's quality t-shirt. Printing, printing is really nice, actually. It's not that kind of rubbery stuff that you get with some companies that print their own stuff. It's a really nice t-shirt. So yeah, that's Sonic the Hedgehog. Too slow. It's pretty cool. And then t-shirt number two. It's interesting. Two video game t-shirts. So we've got one Sega Sonic t-shirt and we've got a Nintendo one. This is a green. It's interesting to get a green one rather than a... <laughs> okay then. Interesting, uh, let's just say that. You've got one of Bowser's kids sitting on a pipe, taking a dump that actually turns out to be coins. Okay, now that gives a whole new meaning to uh, Mario now. So you're basically collecting Bowser kid dumps when you collect coins. Anyway, that's pretty funny, I kind of like that. Again, Guild and Soft style. That print's a little rubberier compared to the uh, the, the Sonic one, this one feels more like they've kind of done that. Yeah, it's got like the kind of aftermarket rub on it to soften it down, whereas this this one doesn't. But yeah, so we've got a green t-shirt, a black t-shirt. Obviously they both they both come from the video game category that I picked. Just thought I'd do a quick update. Tried both t-shirts on, as you can see. Got the Bowser one on. Um, sizes, both supposed to be the same size. That one, a little shorter. A little tighter. The neck is definitely tighter on the Sonic one. This one's got a more of a looser neck. Longer fit, slightly looser. It's supposed to be the same, but it's not, not too much of a difference, but just to bear in mind that if you are picking your size, you know, make sure I'd probably go higher size rather than on the lower end. Um, they go from I think small all up to 3XL, so you know, if you're a chunky monkey like myself, you can get big t-shirts. Because um, I don't like to wear anything that tight fit. Um, but yeah, 
like I say, the, the, there's some differences in the material, even though they're both guild and soft style. Um, but yeah, they're pretty cool. Fits pretty well. I rock a green t-shirt. So yeah, just thought I'd give you a quick post try on update. Like I said, you'll see pictures of us. If you follow me on Instagram, at Phil Wheat, um, you'll have to see me rocking both t-shirts. Um, so yeah, that's Monthly Tea Club. That's pretty cool. Um, they're really heavily into social media, so you can check them out on, on Facebook. They have an Instagram account where they really help you know, they want the people to get the boxes in their t-shirts to put their t-shirts on and, and hashtag them and stuff. Uh, so yeah, that's Monthly Tea Club. That's pretty cool. Hope you enjoyed that. We'll be trying the t-shirts on afterwards. You'll probably see it on Instagram. Um, but for now, I'll say bye-bye. Catch you all later.